Yeah, off season has been, it's been good. Like, it was, it was something I really needed. It's just kind of just to relax and finally be with the family. I haven't seen them in so long now. Being all the way in like North Carolina, you know, more flights and stuff like that, it was hard for them to come by. So I think that's where I realized how much I really miss my family, how important they are to me, just being away. So it's been hard, but I mean, I think it's something I did need. And it's home, you know, like, it's, it's a lot of memories. I grew up here, I always had dreams, you know, like I always had dreams of what I wanted to do in the future. And like East Hartford is just where everything started. So that's me growing up with this stadium here. Like, you know, you see, you watch the US national team come and play and everything. And it's just like, oh man, I want to be there one day, you know? I think everything started here. Everything started here before I went to Eastern, before everything it was East Hartford. When I was about 13, I was like, I was like, wow, I really, like, I really want to play. I really want to become a professional soccer player. But I was like, I don't know how to though. Like, I don't know how, where that works, like who I have to meet and stuff like that. But I kind of always said like, I'm just gonna trust the process. Like I'm just gonna see what, what pans out and then go from there. So as I grew and stuff like that, and I kept getting older, it's, that dream just kept sticking with me. Like it stuck with me, it stuck with me every day. And then I went to Eastern. I just kept my head down, just kept working, kept working. And then as I got to Rhode Island, that's when I was like, all right, I, I see it. It could, it could actually come to play now. So it was just like always in the back of my head, like no matter what I did, everything I did is like, I just want to become a professional, you know? But I didn't know how, and I was just praying that it'll come to pass. And fortunately it did. Yeah, it's the high school right here. It's cool, cause when I was here, like they, they didn't have that sign yet. You come back and you're just like, wow. Like, I was here, I was a student had big dreams myself. He wants people to look up to you and, and have someone that they go, they like, oh, I wanna be like Pat, you know? And I really wanted to do that here because no one really has done it. I haven't really met anyone that's been a professional from like out of East Hartford. So it's like, it's kind of cool to be one of like the first guys, you know? Literally that field right there, all that over there was our JV field. I think it's still JV now and like a wall board, we just kick against the wall. Yeah, it's crazy. You know, a lot of people would think like, oh, it's not possible to make it from where you're from or the route I took, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't like a regular route where you go straight to D1, play a great year D1 and you go. Like, I went through a lot of like ups and downs, you know, so I think it's cool to have a, a unique um, kind of resume, so now, People could look at it and be like, okay, if he could do it, then I could do it too. At the end of the day, no one has been where I've been and the journey is it took me to get here. It's, it's been crazy. So I don't, I don't really, nothing really phases me when someone says like, I'm not good enough or this and that, cause I've heard that, you know? So if you're saying it now and I'm here, like that's still not gonna phase me. I'm just gonna keep showing what I can do and prove everybody wrong. Yeah, we used to play big pickup games here. In the summer, we used to get we used to get so many guys here and just play. I think, especially when you're when you're in a new club, like you want you want yourself to be a part of his, history, you know. Like you want people to to remember you for what you've done for a new club. So I feel like for myself is like I wanna I wanna bring joy into the city. Like I wanna help bring joy into the city. I wanna help um, the fans enjoy. I want people to remember Charlotte for what they've achieved. I wanna, I wanna get a trophy, you know? I wanna get a trophy in the cabinet for, for this new league team. So it's ideal to be in a new club and be a new professional to, and new to everything. It's like, I just wanna help as much as possible. Keep doing what I love to do. Just be a role model to, to more people. That's, that's it, that's what I wanna do. Help my family, you know, that's it. Family's doing okay, I'm doing okay, man. <laughs>